So what is living on the bounce? Living on the bounce. Bounce around to free anchorages. Living rent free. Uh, traveling the seas of Southern California. That's the bounce right there. You guys haven't seen Solar Man's new home. Pretty cool. Yeah. Oh yeah, real cool. You got Caribbeus. I worked on that engine and worked on that boat. Can I ask you a question or two? Ah, certainly. Ask me no questions, I'll tell you no lies. <laughs> What's your name and where are you from? P. Daly and from downtown Boston in the combat zone, aka San Diego for a while. 25, 30 years here. What is living on the bounce? Uh, freedom from uh, fees, money, taking you down. You just live on the water for free without having uh, anybody telling you what to do. So why do they call it the bounce? Because you're only allowed three days here and three days there by the U.S. government and uh, our fellow citizens who write the laws decided to uh, keep San Diego flowing. If you're from outside, like Europe or someplace, come in here, you're allowed for three months, but otherwise they want you to bounce out of town and get out. And if you're a local, they don't want you to even stay if you're uh, living on a boat. They want you to get out of town. What's the hardest part of living on the boat? Trying to talk your girlfriend into swimming to your boat. There's uh, somebody for, for everything, really. There's a mechanic, there's an electrician, there's a, you know, boat salesman. There's, uh, there's just about everyone. People from all walks of life. Uh, just the experience in getting away from from uh, the grid. I mean, being self-sustaining, having your own power, you know, not paying rent, uh, just having and doing for yourself and, and living as a human is really what it's about. Well, you see, the the Port of San Diego has kind of uh, tried to outlaw uh, liveaboards in San Diego Harbor. So basically, they give us uh, three permits for three three days each, uh, nine days total for the month uh, to be in the harbor. So we stretch it out between uh, this free anchorage that's uh, three miles offshore, uh, three miles to the closest public access lands. Uh, of anything around but serves as our home base in between these uh, anchorages and then we use um, Mission Bay as well so you can go to Mission Bay for the three days during the week come back to one of the anchorages here in San Diego Bay and then back to the free anchorage completes the week and you can stretch it out through the month and, and eventually you know you're living on the bounce the sunrises are the are the best the, the sunsets are amazing couldn't ask for better as I sit back a couple miles offshore looking back at society thinking this is, this is it. This is it. <laughs> Here's the dock where we are now. Hi puppy. Then we have La Playa Cove where we can stay for the weekends. And then Glorietta Bay all the way over here. And then the shoal, the Zuniga Shoal. The home base is actually way out here in the Pacific Ocean. So it's unprotected waters except for uh, a slight uh, jetty. And then Mission Bay that's up here. And that is the bounce. Yeah. It's trying. It has its uh, 
times where perseverance pays off, but uh, ultimately it's the most liberating natural freedom that you could experience. Adventure or an, or, or an ordeal? <laughs> what happened here? Uh, tried to repair a little leak and, and maybe made it a little worse. But water got to it before my patch cured. So, time to start over. It's always fun. How long have you lived on the belts? Uh, going on two years. Doing the same thing. You just never know what you're gonna get into. It's always something new.